And now to the growing number of shootings inside Houston restaurants. Thank you for joining us. I'm Keith Garvin. And I'm Christine Noel. Houston police say the latest shooting happened inside of a sushi restaurant and the gunman was taken down by one UFC fighter and his friend. Last night's shooting was just one of several in our area recently and tonight we're asking a security expert what you should do if gunfire erupts while you're dining out. Our Michael Lapardi is live in Highland Village with some tips that could potentially save your life. Michael. Keith, tonight we spoke with the owner of a security company who emphasized that each situation is a little different, but offered some general tips if you find yourself in a similar situation. Houston police say dozens of people were inside this sushi restaurant when a man fired a shot into the ceiling. And while no one was hurt here, it's not the first incident of gunfire at a restaurant in the Houston area. Back in August, Houston police said two men died after they were shot while dining on the patio of this Italian restaurant in the Galleria area. And in July, police said three people were shot in what was called a murder-suicide at the aquarium restaurant downtown. So if somebody starts shooting in a public place, you and I both know that's completely uncommon. That's not normal behavior. That's not civil behavior. That's not safe behavior. While the details of each case are different, we asked Perfetto Escabel what people need to know to help protect themselves. He owns a company that's provided security for religious groups and businesses. The number one thing you should do is be aware of your surroundings. In addition, make sure that you know where your alternate exits are in that building. Because if a shooting does break out, how can I get myself or my family out of here quickly? And while each situation is different, he offered these basic principles. Run if you can run. Hide if you can't run. Then hide. Barricade yourself in a room. Put heavy objects in front of the doors. And then finally, if that shooter does come in, you've got to fight. And in this latest situation, police said they don't know what the suspect's intention was, but that a patron was able to take the gun away from him. We are live along Westheimer tonight. Michael Lopardi, KPRC 2 News.